Think back to those grainy black and white screens, the hum of old television sets, and the anticipation of the opening credits. Somewhere in those memories, you might find Tippi Hedren, an iconic figure whose presence left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Whether you recall her poised elegance in Hitchcock's suspenseful tales or her later endeavors, Tippi's essence is like a familiar face you've known for years. Now, as we journey into random facts about Tippi Hedren, let's uncover the lesser-known facets of her life that deserve the spotlight. From her courageous spirit to her unexpected beginnings, Tippi's story is one that intertwines with the tapestry of Hollywood's history. So, without further ado, let's peel back the layers and reveal the intriguing facts that shape Tippi Hedren's captivating narrative. Get ready to embark on a journey through time, exploring the moments that define this remarkable woman. Buckle up, for this is a ride you won't want to miss. And now, without delaying any longer, let's dive into the world of Tippi Hedren, a name that resonates with charisma and grace. Tippi Hedren's enduring legacy, Shambhala Wildlife Preserve nestled in the heart of California's picturesque landscape. The Shambhala Wildlife Preserve stands as a testament to Tippi Hedren's unwavering commitment to wildlife conservation. Established by Hedren in 1983, the sanctuary remains a thriving refuge for exotic big cats to this day. With a passion ignited during the filming of Alfred Hitchcock's The Birds in 1963, Hedren found herself captivated not only by her role as Melanie Daniels, but also by the avian stars of the film. Her portrayal of Melanie, which clinched the 86th spot on Premier Magazine's 100 Greatest Movie Characters of All Time, solidified her status as an iconic actress. Yet, her love for nature extended beyond the silver screen. Amidst the glitz and glamour of Hollywood, Hedren's dedication took a tangible form in the Shambhala Preserve. This sanctuary, spanning over 80 acres, provided a haven for lions, tigers, and other big cats, many of which were retired from the entertainment industry. Hedren's passion for these creatures led her to not only establish Shambhala, but also to raise awareness about the ethical treatment of animals in show business. Her commitment was undeniable. Even as she faced challenges, like the time she purchased an elephant for a film but charged it to the production company, Hedren's resolve remained unshaken. This tenacity, combined with her vision for Shambhala, allowed her to create a lasting impact on wildlife preservation and animal welfare. Today, Shambhala endures as a living testament to Hedren's compassion and vision. Guided by her daughter, Melanie Griffith, and a dedicated team, the preserve remains a safe haven for its feline residents. Hedren's pioneering spirit continues to inspire a new generation of conservationists and serves as a reminder that the intersection of cinema and wildlife conservation can spark lasting change. In the realm of Hollywood, Tippi Hedren's legacy extends far beyond her iconic film roles. Her devotion to the Shambhala Wildlife Preserve stands as a lasting tribute to her commitment to protecting Earth's most majestic creatures, ensuring that her influence will be felt for generations to come. Marnie, Tippi Hedren's enduring affection amidst turmoil among Tippi Hedren's array of film credits, Marnie stands as a testament to her enduring admiration. This enduring affection is notable, particularly given the tumultuous circumstances that surrounded the film's creation. The 1964 psychological thriller, directed by Alfred Hitchcock, saw Hedren tackling the complex titular character. Her affinity for Marnie remains pronounced even when considering the numerous obstacles that marred its production, leading to the fracture of her professional ties with Hitchcock. The film's inception followed Hedren's star-turning appearance in a 1961 commercial during The Today Show. Alfred Hitchcock's discerning eye caught her slender figure and charm, setting the stage for her iconic role in The Birds. This connection went beyond mere casting, and inside joke orchestrated by Hitchcock had her character, both in the commercial and the film, encountering the same appreciative whistle while walking down the street. Yet, it was Marnie that continued to hold sway in Hedren's heart. The intricate layers of the title character resonated with her, and despite the clashes between the director and actress during filming, the role's depth persisted as her favorite. Hitchcock's demanding style, coupled with mixed reviews and indifferent box office results upon the film's release, marked a turning point in their collaboration. Hedren's steadfast admiration for Marnie reveals the complexity of her relationship with both the role and its director. 
As time passed, her resolve to honor the character she portrayed in the midst of adversity remains a testament to her unwavering dedication to Tippi her Tippi Hedren, the iconic actress known for her captivating performances, left an indelible mark on Hollywood. Most intriguingly, a pattern emerged within her filmography, an alphabetic quirk that seemed too coincidental to be happenstance. A closer examination reveals that, save for the exception of Tiger by the Tail, Hedron's characters bore names that initiated with the letter M from the spirited Melanie Daniels in The Birds to the enigmatic Marnie Edgar in Marnie, and on to an array of other M-starting monikers. This trend persisted in nearly all her pre-1982 films. This curious consistency could be seen as a testament to the subtleties she brought to her roles, a quiet thread connecting seemingly disparate characters. However, beneath the cinematic oddity lay the passionate heart of an animal rights advocate. Despite her roles in films that often portrayed luxury and extravagance, Hedron made a profound shift when she embraced the cause of animal welfare. Her evolution from Hollywood starlet to conservationist was marked by a particularly striking gesture, a rejection of fur. Shedding her on-screen glamour, she chose to forsake fur after embracing the principles of animal rights. This choice was a testament to her commitment to promoting compassion and raising awareness about animal cruelty in the fashion industry. The dichotomy of Tippi Hedren, the actress who skillfully portrayed diverse personas on screen and the activist who fervently championed animal rights off screen, exemplifies the complexity of human nature. Her journey from embodying M names to shedding fur stands as a unique tale of transformation, where the roles she played in life were just as powerful as those she portrayed in her films. In 1966, amidst the elegant ambience of London's Claridge's, a tense encounter unfolded between actress Tippi Hedren and the iconic director Alfred Hitchcock, along with his wife Alma Reville. This meeting marked their final interaction, fueled by an underlying bitterness. Hedren, then filming Charles Chaplin's last work, a countess from Hong Kong, found herself at the center of Hitchcock's dismay. Cast in a pivotal role, her involvement thwarted Hitchcock's aspirations for the film's grandeur. Their strained tea-time conversation reflected his unspoken resentment. The intricate dynamics of this rendezvous highlighted the unspoken tensions between Hitchcock and Hedren. The actress had emerged under Hitchcock's tutelage, earning fame in The Birds, where her on-screen elegance masked the turmoil behind the scenes. The film's iconic green dress, worn by Hedron during the infamous bird attack scene, became emblematic. Remarkably, Hitchcock bestowed this very attire upon her as a parting gift during their London tea. This gesture juxtaposed his private bitterness with a public facade of generosity. Beyond her cinematic legacy, Hedron's personal life intertwined with Hollywood's. She was the mother of Melanie Griffith, another notable name in the industry. The complexities of their family dynamics mirrored the intricate roles Hedron played on screen. In the annals of Hollywood history, Tippi Hedron's final meeting with Alfred Hitchcock stands as a testament to the complexities of talent and ambition, concealed beneath a veneer of social pleasantries. As the shadows of their encounter melded with the glamour of London's elite, the unspoken emotions of that tea time linger as a symbol of a fading collaboration. In a world where images everything, this meeting at Claridge's serves as a poignant reminder of the struggles that often accompany stardom. Tippi Hedren, beyond the silver screen's glare in the realm of Hollywood's luminaries, Tippi Hedren's name gleams with an eclectic constellation of connections. Her devotion to wildlife advocacy, particularly her stewardship of the Roar Foundation, an animal preserve near Los Angeles, sets her apart from the cinematic crowd. Yet, it's her lineage's intersections with Johnny Depp that illuminate her life's intricate tapestry. Though Hedron herself hasn't crossed paths with the enigmatic Depp, her familial orbits intertwine in fascinating ways. A fervent admirer, she christened one of her house cats after the elusive star. This gesture stems from familial ties. Her then son-in-law, Antonio Banderas, collaborated with Depp in Once Upon a Time in Mexico, while her granddaughter, Dakota Johnson, graced the screen with him in 21 Jump Street in Black Mass. Beneath the glitz of Tinseltown, Hedron's heart beats for a cause. A curious incident catalyzed her affinity for animal preservation. 
Filming roar in the 80 seconds, Hedren observed a disconcerting reality, the rampant use of big cat cages in Hollywood. Prompted by this, she procured her own land to establish a sanctuary, where lions, tigers, and other majestic creatures could roam freely. Presiding over the Roar Foundation, Hedrin embarks on an unwavering mission to nurture these creatures, unraveling an intimate liaison between celebrity and stewardship. Her journey reflects a life carved not just on celluloid, but etched with a devotion that roars beyond the silver screen. In an industry enamored with flash and glamour, Tippy Hedron radiates a unique luminescence, a luminary who swaps spotlights for sanctuaries, epitomizing Hollywood's unexpected connections. As the final curtain falls on our journey through the enigmatic world of Tippy Hedron, we find ourselves caught in the delicate strands of time that connect us to her captivating performances. Just as she portrayed characters that linger in the chambers of our hearts, so too have her talents woven themselves into the tapestry of entertainment history. With each role she undertook, Tippy Hedron not only brought to life a character, but also invited us to explore the depths of our own emotions. Her grace, her intensity, and her ability to hold us spellbound on both the silver screen and the edges of our thoughts are testaments to her exceptional artistry. Now, as we stand at this crossroads of memory and admiration, I invite you to embark on a personal journey. Reflect on the moments when her performances resonated with your soul, when her presence ignited that flicker of connection that transcends time and space. What were you feeling as she navigated through those intricate plots? How did her portrayals resonate with your own experiences? Share those cherished fragments of emotion and insight, for they form the mosaic of Tippi Hedren's impact. Let your thoughts dance with the echoes of her characters, and as you do, remember that your unique perspective adds to the legacy she has left behind. Like the hues of a painting, your memories contribute to the vibrant canvas of her influence. In this realm where cinema and reality intertwine, we bid farewell with gratitude for Tippi Hedren's lasting contribution. Her talent has left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment, and we, the audience she captivated, stand as living witnesses to her brilliance. Thank you for sharing this reflective moment with us. Your time, your thoughts, and your appreciation all contribute to the tribute we pay to an exceptional artist. Until our paths cross again on this journey through stories and memories, be well and keep the spirit of Tippi Hedron alive in your heart.